Well, I'm Deputy Slope. You don't have a license plate on this thing. Oh, man. And you're in a 35 mile an hour zone here, and you're at 60 miles an hour when you cross that 35 mile per hour zone. I have the weapon. Okay. Okay. Yeah, don't touch that. Yeah. Okay. So, um, hang tight there. Let's just take that out. Oh, yeah, no. Keep that easy. Hey, that fence. I like those. We'll just leave that there. All right. I can tell you're late. So I'm Deputy Slope. I work for the Pinal County Sheriff's Office Traffic. You want me to see your driver's license? And uh, the reason I stopped you is you were speeding on Sunland Gin. The posted speed limit there is 50. Yeah. And I and I didn't even mean didn't even mean to drive today because uh, is your license suspended? I needed to get my interlock today. Okay. And I just needed to take her to work, and, and that was all I was. That's all I was doing today, and that, that was it. I. And so your license is suspended for a DUI. Yes, sir. Okay. And, until January, and I, and I just needed to do this one thing, and that's. I was already extremely stressed about even doing it. I can tell. I can tell by your demeanor. And so I. I... Mm, okay. You have any weapons in your car? Just, just a forty-five. If you would like me to get out, I can get out. Mm -hmm. Just keep your hands where I can see them. I can do that. Okay. So, I'm glad that you told me because I'm looking at it and I was just wanting to yeah, see I'm, if you were going to tell me the truth or yeah, not. I'm, 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 I'm completely ecstatic right now. I'm. I don't think ecstatic's the right word because that would mean that you would be excited to see okay. me, and I don't feel like you're excited to see me. No, I'm sure. So, excite, ecstatic might not be the proper use of that word, but it's okay. I appreciate the, the attempt at a, at a broad vocabulary. Keep leaning just like that. I'm just gonna grab that out of there. Hey, I appreciate a 1911 shooter. Shooting ball ammo. You keep looking for that, I'll be back. Lots of people carry guns, so we are used to dealing with people, and we just, we deal with it accordingly. Not a big deal. Um, Arizona's a gun-carrying state. We're a proud Second Amendment state. Obviously, my boss is, is all about the, the freedom of the Second Amendment. Um, and making sure you have guns with you. You're contacted on a traffic stop. Exactly what that guy did was perfect. Put his hands up here. And he's like, hey, do you, you know, my gun is right there. He didn't reach for it, because then I reached for mine and that, that goes bad. Let the officer dictate is really the, the best way to handle when you have a gun in the car. Um, but we never want to be taken by surprise of like you open up the glove box, reaching for your registration and there's a block in there. We don't know if you're reaching for your registration or your Glock, so if you're, you keep your gun in your glove box, say, hey, before I open that up, I'll let you know that there's a gun in there. Your license is not suspended. I thought it was. I know. And that, that's where the problem lies, is that you, like, you know that driving is a privilege, right? Yeah. You don't have a right to drive, and you're like, yeah, I'm going to drive anyway. Luckily, you're not violating any laws except for not having your seatbelt on and your speed, but as far as your license is fine. So this is just catalyst for wearing your seatbelt, catalyst for slowing down, okay? Yes, um, now, if you did that, I would be ecstatic. Okay. I can, I can, I, All right. I can do that. Very cool, I appreciate that. So, I'm Deputy Slope, I work for the Sheriff's Office. Um, I'm good friends with Sheriff Lambs. Outstanding. Yeah. No one cares about that. It, during a traffic stop, there's no reason to bring that up under any circumstances. Because strange enough, so am I. Well, I'm Deputy Slope. I work for the Pinal County Sheriff's Office Traffic Unit. The reason I stopped you is speed limit on this road is 35. Okay. And you accelerated to a top speed of 58. She'll run out of gas here. Did you say you're going to run out of gas? Yeah. Totally oh. Really well. I feel like your engine works more efficiently not at higher speeds. Yeah. I think that's a thing. I don't know. I'm not a mechanic, but that's a thing. I feel like you got to wear your seatbelt. I feel like seatbelts are important for yeah. staying safe. I know. All right. By any chance, are you, are you low on blinker fluid today? Blinker fluid? Yeah. Like, no. Because it didn't. It didn't work? Like your blinker didn't work there? Did you just not use it? Oh, it does work. Okay. Because, so I'm Deputy Slope. I work for the Pinal County Sheriff's Office Traffic Unit. The initial reason I stopped you was you're 67 miles an hour in a posted 45 out on Hunt. And then when you change lanes from the right lane to the left lane, and then the left lane into the left turn lane, none of those movements were indicated by any sort of use of any blinker anywhere.
You are more than double the speed limit here. Oh. So, you know what the speed limit is here? I don't. Do you feel like that might be an important yes, piece of yes, information? Yes, yes. Okay, so, so see, I I have, just, you have like people's houses here, yeah, the roadway yeah. here. I actually live right in the neighborhood back here. I just moved here. So why do you have an Illinois identification card? Um, so because right now I'm in between licenses. Uh, Which means your license is suspended. Yeah, so. Okay. Um, so let's let's just say, hey man, my license, yeah, in, yeah. It, no, yeah like in between houses, where you're like, oh man, I got some of my stuff here. I got some, well, your license is suspended. So, what, what passenger, do you have a good license? Yes. Yeah, okay. So, wife. so, my wife. Um, so why isn't wife driving? Is this like a machismo uh, thing? Are you like, man, I got to drive? I guess you can call it that. I'm not gonna be. I'm gonna be real honest with you. All right. I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. Let's go with the good news first. Okay, so your license does not appear to be suspended out of Illinois. Oh, okay, okay, word. The bad news is you're still doing more than double the speed limit and you're still getting a criminal citation for excessive speed. Can you do me a favor? I could do lots of favors. Can you please tell my son to listen to his parents? Put that back, put that back window down. Are you, are you not listening to your parents? You gotta listen to your parents. Here we go, I'll get that to you there. I, I still listen to my mom <laughs> right now. She actually, the other day, she rode along with me and she told me to give someone a warning and I did because I listened to my mom. <laughs> Can I give a sticker? Yeah. Okay. So, promise, promise to listen? Yes. So those are stickers just like my badge. Ooh. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> it's my pleasure. All right. Set a good example. I know. I'm, I'm sitting here telling them, Daddy's a bad boy. I should have been following the law. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're not kidding. Do you want mom, to mom, can you drive, yeah. please? Thank you. Since obviously you're the more responsible of the two. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna. She is the more. By the way, she's not only is she more responsible, but she's smarter than you two, yeah, and hey. she's always gonna be right. I know it. Hey man, I appreciate you being kind. Thank you so much. I feel like one of the two of you should be wearing a seatbelt. No, I just made it take it out right now. You just made her take it off? Yeah. Any reason? Just that I'm pulling over, you guys. So why would you make your passenger no, I, 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 take I, I, her well, seat off? Because of her head. I'm trying to take her to the hospital. Okay. You know, I'm like, I'm in a hurry because she, she, she keeps hurting, but the toolbox is trying to fall, so I'm like, you see the... Okay, that's right a here. very, I, I, very... That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm that's a very, me. very small... Cut yeah, but, that's not actively bleeding. Yeah, but you never know, man. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just a father, man. I'm just trying to hurry okay. up and get it back. Well, you're, you're a father with an identification card at a criminal amount of speed, almost double the posted speed oh, man, limit. I'm sorry for that, man. That's I throw down. I'm sorry. Okay. Now, let's see your registration and current proof insurance. We, I just got the car. So, what's your license suspended for, or revoked, or whatever it is? Um. I never. I, I had one, and uh, I just forgot to go to the damn thing and get get one. So I'm, in, I'm just like, man. Okay, so you're 92 in a 55. Uh, yeah, and I'm sorry. That's the I apologize for that. I apologize. Okay. That's my. That's my. So fault. when did this? Let's see. I, I just barely got so this. Is, I never. I, I never raised 30 because I. Well, barely is. I, in, I, I, in I barely got money. March. I barely got money right now. Okay. So, so this is in 30. March. So we're March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. That's when, so you're oh, seven. That's when, that's when he got it. I just got the car. I just got the car. That's when he, he signed everything. And he said, they pull you over, just, you know, as long as you're taking it over there. All right. So this is your car, but yeah. it's not registered yet. That's, that's why I'm going to DMV and I got to, first I got to worry about her, then go to DMV. My daughter, I'm concerned about my daughter right now. Sure. You okay? You look okay. You know, like I said, I apologize for that, man. That's good. I, I really Hang, do. Hang tight. They've gone down quite a bit. Now. So, they're, they're the little unrestrained girl in the passenger seat has a cut on her head the size of a nickel. Um, and he's at 92 with no license and no seat belts. I, I just don't understand why, I don't know. I, I, there's so much going on in there. There was like a title that was like half signed and not his car. And I don't, I, 
there's a reason that we leave Santan Valley occasionally. It's so that we can share traffic enforcement with other parts of the county. Um, and out here, it's desolate. The deputies are really far spread out. Um, they've got a lot of calls for service, so they don't they don't pull cars over as much um, because they're busy doing deputy things. Um, so the ability to come out here and just do traffic things is why you get to stop and have contact with people like this um, and issue them lots of sites because he needs that real bad. So driving with your license is suspenders, your first criminal site, criminal speeds, your second criminal site, not wearing your seatbelts, your third, and then not having insurance. Um, and you know that this is a, by law? What do you mean? But this, this is what happened. U.S. Supreme Court says no license necessary yeah. to drive automobiles. Just, yeah, I don't know where that is or what kind of they, weird... They, they just ruled against it. For all the United States citizens. I'm just letting you know. I don't, I yeah. don't know if that's true. That is. Because our, the, the police departments are taking money, literally, at the governments to militarize their own vehicles. I'm just letting you know. And I know the law. We're <laughs> militarizing yeah. our own vehicles? Yeah. Does that look like no, an MRAP to you? I'm not, I'm not talking about that one. But I but I work for the government. Yeah, I know. I know. But I don't have a military vehicle. No, I'm not talking about those. I'm talking about like the foggy and all that stuff. Which they're going to use against the United States citizen later on with the United Nations. A lot of people don't even know them. I'm just letting you know. Okay. A lot of, a lot of people don't know. Okay. That's Interesting. Cool. I mean, I can, hey, I can learn all but, sorts of... Yeah, give me a fist bump. Bop. Thank you for letting you know. No, absolutely. So listen, what, all you have to do is appear, tell that to the judge show him that article and say, hey man, I don't need a license to drive, so even though my license is suspended, I don't need it anyway. All right, and just need your home. signature there. That just says, hey man, go there, talk to the judge, say, hey man, I don't need a license. I am a citizen here and these are my roads, I pay taxes. Um, see what his thoughts are on that. Wherever you're getting, get there safe. Yep, I'm going, right. to, I'm going to dump in a... Uh, All right, and, and just so you know, as soon as you're, so you're gonna go to the dump right now, is that where you're headed? Then I got a ticket to the emergency room. Okay. So you're gonna go to the dump first yeah. and then the emergency room? Because I don't think it's an emergency if you're going to the dump first. I don't know why. Well, you can figure it out. I'll, I'll but just so out. you know, you can't drive, yeah. all right? Because you don't have a license. Okay, Thank you, bye guys.